In this session, we are discussing introduction to algorithm classifications. We are having different types of algorithms and we want to classify them depending upon some features. But before going for the classifications, let me tell you what is an algorithm. We are having a separate video on this algorithm, you can watch that one also. Algorithm means process or set of rules to be followed in calculations or other problem solving operations especially by a computer. So it is nothing but one approach or some set of rules and process towards the solving a certain problem by the computer and that is known as an algorithm. And we know that algorithm is having five properties, it will have, it will have some inputs, outputs, then finiteness, definiteness and effectiveness of the instructions in the algorithm. So we know this algorithm, we have defined that, one, that algorithm in other videos, please watch that one also. But depending upon what, we are actually doing the classifications, depending upon what. So various way towards solving problems. So we will be, we'll be dividing, we will be doing this classifications depending upon the way in which we are going to solve one problem and similar problem solving approach. So whenever some problems are getting solved with a similar approach, we are taking that one as one of the classifications. And if the approach is differing, then that will be going, those algorithms will be going to another classification. Classification scheme is neither exhaustive and nor disjoint. So that's why they might, might be having some approach which is overlapping and this is not exhaustive in that sense. But depending upon the way in which we are, we are attacking one problem towards this solution, that will decide what is the classification we are dealing with. So here, mainly here, the list of categories, whatever we have listed is simple recursive algorithms, backtracking algorithms, divide and conquer algorithms, dynamic programming algorithms, greedy algorithms, branch and bound algorithms, brute force algorithms and randomized algorithms. So these are the main eight categories we can form, we can formulate here. So simple recursive algorithm means here the recursion will be out in a very simple way, in a very, in a very normal way. It does not indicate that there is no other algorithm that will be using no recursion. That is not an issue. Issue is that in case of simple recursive algorithm, we will be doing the recursion but not in a very complicated way. So for each and every category, we will be having our separate videos for the better understanding and for the better explanation with the examples. Please watch all those videos to have this idea how these algorithms are getting classified. So please watch the next videos. They, those videos will be in the continuation of this one. Thanks for watching this one.